we are back at it and we're talking about the official confirmation by square enix that marvel's avengers has not yet made a profit or even recouped its huge development cost let's get to that and what does this mean When it comes to operating costs, there is many companies out there who have their numbers made public. Now, it was only a couple of weeks ago that we heard that Marvel's Avengers wasn't doing that good. And of course, you had the naysayer saying that this isn't true. They built their entire identity online around this product, so they had to say everybody was lying. When it was pretty evident, the moment you looked at the player base and the moment you looked at the initial sales rush and then the drop off in sales, that this game was not doing good. And the rumors were that the game has, uh, well, struck to really uh, resonate with people. Now, the latest report officially coming from Square Enix is the fact that their last fiscal quarter, which saw the release of Marvel's Avengers, officially tanked. And they say this is due to the Avengers, because had Avengers not released, they actually would have posted a profit. And approximately $67 million of operating loss were put on file with the estimated expenses of the game costing upwards of $100 million, meaning that they still got a long way to go. And they've only sold about 60% of what they plan to sell in that fiscal quarter, meaning things are looking really bad. Now, if we look at the messaging to the players, everything is going good. If you look at their social media accounts, because they're not going to come out and go, yeah, we, uh, we bombed. Yeah. Now, there has been a push to get more copies to sell, whether that's at a reduced price or trying to put more buzz behind it. And I think seeing as Black Friday and everything, once those numbers come out, we're going to see a pretty decent jump in player base again. But the sustainability of this game will be how fast can they get content out? The massive problem is, as with any games as a service, pretty much since they began, once you get to the end, there's barely any content. And most people say, I don't want to just grind the same five missions over and over. I want more single player, which I think the takeaway here is they should have just done a single player game for $100 million. And uh, they really could have recouped a lot more money had they sold it as something like that, which we've seen EA for years say single player games don't sell. And then Star Wars Fallen Order becomes one of their biggest games of all time. So uh, I think this game is just suffering from a lot of problems and i think next quarter it will really be interesting to see what they say about this game because if it goes another quarter and it doesn't turn a profit this game is dead that that's it uh, that's honestly it i'm telling you right now this game will not survive past the next quarter if it doesn't recover 